Okay, Lee, as you know, Boston's Day is coming up, so I'm going to put you on the spot and ask you a few questions. (laughs) What is your favorite part of being a boss? Okay, so my favorite part of being a boss is being able to interact with all of the wonderful people that I get to work with here at LeBron and Nutrition every day and interacting with our raving fans and followers. And what is your least favorite part about being a boss? My least favorite part of being a boss has to be crunching numbers. At a bodybuilding competition, what's the funniest or weirdest thing that's ever happened to you? So let me think about that for a second. Probably the funniest thing that ever happened to me at a bodybuilding competition, I had this great big friend of mine, fellow bodybuilder Paul Gillette, who's 6'1 and probably like 260 pounds, stand in front of me when I was doing a pose, during a pose down. So he just basically walked right in front of me to block me out. And so <laughs> instead of getting mad, what I did was I took my, my, uh, my, my hand like this and I just kind of put it over his head like that and he couldn't understand why everybody started laughing they thought he thought that they were laughing at him <laughs> so that's probably the funniest thing that happened that's great who is your favorite bodybuilder and you can't pick yourself okay so then i'm going to pick my son hunter labrada who is uh, one of the top amateurs in the country and getting ready for the nationals awesome who is your favorite employee i love all of them <laughs> equally i love all of them equally sure you do what is the strangest talent that you have? The strangest talent that I have is that I play guitar and I sing and I record albums. And a lot of people don't know that. What is one thing on your bucket list? Um, lunch with Paul McCartney. Okay. What was the first big purchase you made with your own money? Oh, that's an easy one. It's uh, when I bought my first house. So that was, that was a big milestone. What are you currently watching on Netflix? Nothing, because I don't watch TV, which is kind of odd, but I uh, literally don't turn the TV on except to watch the occasional football game. And what's your football team of choice? Ah, I would have to say Texas A&M, sometimes University of Texas. You know, I am an equal lover of Texas football. House divided. House divided. (laughs) What did you crave the most during prep? And that's easy. That would be a salted caramel lean body, RTD. (laughs) (laughs) What was your first job? My first job, believe it or not, was painting houses. So I used to paint houses uh, during the summers to make money so that I could go to college. What is your Starbucks order? Very simple. I keep it very simple. And so it's a double tall Americana with room for cream. What did you want to be when you grew up? Well, a number of things. Uh, first, I wanted to be a rocket scientist. Literally, I wanted to work in the NASA space program. And then I wanted to be a surgeon. And then later, I wanted to be an engineer, which I became. And then when I was doing engineering, I wanted to become a pro bodybuilder. And I was able to do that as well. So I feel very blessed. Awesome. I'm still trying to grow up. <laughs> Have you ever made a prank call from your work phone? Don't lie. Every day. Every day. I call my wife, I'm going to tell her, it's your secret admirer. <laughs> if you could walk into work with a theme song, what would it be? Oh my gosh. Maybe the Rocky Anthem. Thanks for answering my questions and happy Boston Thank you.